Hello friends, this is Adam with Movie Guy 365 and in this video I will be going over the new 4K Ultra HD Blu-ray pre-orders for June 4th, 2022. Now keep in mind, release dates and technical specs are subject to change. If there are any changes or additional retail or exclusives, I will update them in a future video in the channel's community page. And don't forget, if you're interested in any of these titles, please use the Amazon affiliate link in the comments section below. It really helps out the channel. Pretty much waiting till the last moment, Universal has officially announced this week that Robert Eggers' The Northman will be arriving on 4K. It will have HDR and Dolby Vision for the grading and a Dolby Atmos audio mix. I saw this one in theaters. I expect a really almost reference quality presentation here. And if you want The Northman on 4K, this Tuesday, June 7th, it will be out in stores, and you can pre-order it now. Also from Universal, on June 21st, we'll see the release of the animated feature, The Bad Guys. It will have HDR and Adobe Atmos audio track. I've heard this one is pretty good. I may check it out, and it's a shame there aren't any retail or exclusives for this one as of this recording. So if you want it, pick this one up on the 21st. On June 28th, Warner Brothers will have Fantastic Beasts, the Secrets of Dumbledore on 4K. It will support HDR and Dolby Vision and of course a Dolby Atmos audio track. And like the previous two films, Best Buy will of course include a 4K Ultra HD Steelbook Edition only available at that retailer online and it should be available in stores on release day. I will of course be opting for the Steelbook Edition of the film. Let me know in the comments which version, if any, you plan on picking up for yourself. On July 5th, Lionsgate will release Everything Everywhere All at Once on 4K. It will support HDR as well as Dolby Vision and a Dolby Atmos audio track. I saw this one in theaters. It's fantastic and I can't wait to pick this one up for myself. Walmart will have an exclusive 4K edition of the film only available at that retailer and on their website. If you've seen the film, you know the reference that the cover is implying here. I like the artwork. I understand a couple people with phobias may not dig it, but uh, I think it's unique. And if you want it, Walmart will have this one on July 5th. On July 19th, Sony will be re-releasing the Men in Black trilogy in one collection. Now, if you recall, earlier in June, they will be releasing the first film with a new Dolby Vision grading. The official specs have not been released by Sony for this trilogy, so there's no word if all three of these films will support the new Dolby Vision grade, but you may want to hold off on that until the actual specs have been announced by Sony. So at the very least, expect HDR and Dolby Atmos for the audio. Also on July 19th, Lionsgate will release the Gerard Butler sci-fi film Gamer on 4K. It reportedly will support HDR and Dolby Vision, as well as a new Dolby Atmos audio track. I've never seen this one. It looked kind of interesting, and fans of the film can pick this one up on the 19th. Also on the same day from Lionsgate will be the 4K release of The Kid. It will support HDR as well as a DTS 5.1 audio mix. If you've never seen the film, it's a pretty cool western. It has Ethan Hawke and Chris Pratt actually doing a villain role, which is pretty unusual for him. So yeah, check this one out. It will be available on the 19th. On July 26th, Lionsgate will have Barb and Star go to Vista Del Mar arriving on 4K. It will have HDR and a DTS 5.1 audio mix. I'll be honest with you, my wife and I couldn't even get 20 minutes into this movie, but I do understand it has its fans, so if you're one of those fans, the 4K edition will be available at the end of July. The Nicolas Cage action film Primal will be arriving on 4K on July 26th. It will have HDR for the grade and a DTS 5.1 audio mix. I thought it would maybe warrant an Atmos upgrade, but apparently not, so check it out if you're a fan of Nicolas Cage and Primal. Arrow Video will release a 4K Ultra HD edition of the classic film Flatliners on August 2nd. It will have HDR and Dolby Vision and a DTS 5.1 audio mix. It's been a number of years since I've watched this one, so I can't wait to check it out on 4K. On August 16th, Sonic the Hedgehog 2 will be arriving on physical media in a 4K edition. It will support HDR and Dolby Vision and a Dolby Atmos audio track. I really enjoyed the first film, so I'm looking forward to watching the sequel on 4K. The retailer Best Buy will have an exclusive 4K Steelbook edition of Sonic 2 available in their stores and on their website. 
Those that are familiar with the game know that this pretty much copies the artwork from one of those. So I like it a lot. I will be picking this one up. Let me know in the comments if you will do the same. On the 16th, Shout Select will release the 1984 Red Dawn on 4K. This is a very welcome surprise. I've had the Blu-ray edition in my wish list for years. I've been hoping for a 4K upgrade and now we have it. It will reportedly support HDR and Dolby Vision as well as a new Dolby Atmos audio track. So this one's getting the full treatment on 4K and I couldn't be more excited for this release. In addition, Best Buy will have an exclusive 4K steelbook of Red Dawn available in their stores and on their website. Both versions will be available on August 16th. Let me know if you plan on picking one of them up. Chucky fans will have a lot to enjoy on August 16th with all three films arriving on 4K from Shout Factory Screen Factory. Now the official specs have not been announced yet, but I'm expecting HDR and Dolby Vision for the grading and at the very least a DTS 5.1, but I wouldn't be surprised if we got an Atmos upgrade. Child's Play 2 will also arrive from Screen Factory Shout Factory on the same day. I feel that Child's Play 2 is one of the sequels that's probably just as good, if not a little bit better than the original, and I'm excited that it's getting a 4K release. Child's Play 3 will also arrive on August 16th on 4K. I've got to be honest, I believe I've only seen this one probably once, so I'll be revisiting it just like the other two films. Let me know in the comments if you're going to be picking up any of the Child's Play movies on 4K Ultra HD. On August 30th, Shout Factory will release the 4K Ultra HD Deluxe Edition of the animated feature, Bell. Now, when I mean Deluxe Edition, it's going to be pricier than what you would get for a standard release. It will also include a bunch of swag related to the film. It will support HDR and Dolby Vision and a DTS 5.1 audio mix. I think I'm going to wait for the standard edition because I really want to see this one on 4K. But uh, for those that like the extra stuff, the Deluxe Edition will be available on August 30th. So those are the newest 4K Ultra HD Blu-ray pre-orders for June 4th, 2022. Don't forget to use the Amazon affiliate link in the comments section below. And also let me know, what are you planning to pick up on 4K Blu-ray in the coming months? And finally, I want to thank all my Patreons for your continued support. It is very much appreciated. If you would like to support me through Patreon, I will leave a link in the description of this video. In the meantime, please like, subscribe, hit that bell notification. So until next time, this is Anna with Movie Guy 365. I will see you at the movies.